You don't need this many pairs of pants. Only girls need this many pairs of pants. Shake it like a top, shake it like a top. These are, are the, this shirt. Hey guys, it's Clelea and welcome back to my channel. I am super duper duper excited for today's video. It's gonna be very fun, very different from anything I've really done in a long time. Actually, I've never done this type of video. You probably already know from the title, I'm going to be DIYing some of my dad's clothes. I'm very excited, but again, super duper 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 nervous because me and my dad are different sides. See, my dad and me, we're not exactly the same. So, anyways, this is gonna be super fun. So, before we get onto this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up if you like it and comment down below other DIY videos you'd like to see because I'm thinking of doing some more because I think this will be super duper fun. Anyways, let's just get on to this video. All right, you guys, so your girl over here is going to go upstairs and I'm gonna go get my dad's clothes. We're gonna, just gonna go find like two or three different items that I don't exactly see him wear or I don't ever wanna see him wear. And we're gonna go make them from not cute to absolutely gorgeous. Uh -huh. Yep, I will see you guys upstairs and we're gonna go pick out some super cute, I mean some super not cute outfits. Mm. Some super not cute. <sighs> some super not cute, but almost going to be cute items from his closet. Hopefully he doesn't get mad and maybe rip apart my clothes cause that would be rude. So let's, go upstairs and go get some stuff. All right, you guys, so we're here in my dad's closet and my mom's closet. I'm kind of tempted to just go get some of my mom's cute clothes because they're already cute and I could just like make them a little cuter instead of going from here to like a here. I could go from like a here to a here and make it like, yeah, you know what I'm saying. We're gonna pick out some shirts, but I'm gonna make sure they're ones he doesn't really wear so he doesn't get mad at me. Um, frick, that hurts, ow. This shirt is kind of cute kind of just blank so we could could add some cute designs on that or something um so this is actually quite ugly I'm gonna take that just because I don't want to see him wear that um so sorry dad if you're watching this but I'm taking your clothes so thank you very much for making this video great who the heck would own this many pairs of pants like a dad though why you don't need this many pairs of pants only girls need this many pairs of pants Look at that. What the heck? Well, I guess I can just say, Dad, thank you very much for donating to the cause on the billion pairs of pants you own. This is gonna be hard to wear. I'm not gonna wear those. Can I like alter these just a little bit so that they fit me? This is gonna take forever. Please tell me he doesn't have two drawers of pants. Dad has two pairs of pants. Oh. Two drawers of pants, guys. What is this? Well, more options. Those are cargo shorts. I hate those. Ooh, these are pretty. Oh, and they're, they have the triple, the quad. Wow, how many? One, two, three, four. The quadruple the whole things. Oh my gosh, I can't talk anymore. Oh, here's some mavics. Oh, I ripped something. There's no pocket in this. <laughs> okay, um. This is gonna be great. I think our shopping session is good. We found three outfits, and I'm just gonna keep these because I wanna wear them. All right, you guys, we're here in this little tiny nook area. Meet my plant. I love this plant. It's actually my favorite. This is my DIY nook cranny area. People are watching me. That's not weird. Um, actually, I think I'm going to use this area as my DIY area from now on. All right, so we're gonna start out with my favorite one, this random shirt that says Facebook for creators. And I'm thinking of kind of doing like a, I actually have no idea what I'm gonna do. I'm not really prepared and I never really do DIY videos. So if you can't tell already, I don't know what I'm doing exactly. Okay, so anyways, I'm rambling. Let's get on to this. All right, you guys, so for starters, I guess I should do this way. We've got this beautiful shirt. It's just boring, as you can see. Ooh, there's dots on the back. And it's got this weird thing that says Facebook for creators, which we're going to take off, possibly. So then we are going to need 
a plate, lots of paint. Um, I'm not sure why those are there, but I guess knives, knives could work. And our definite most needed ingredients, not sure what to call it. We've got brushes. We've got these cute brushes that are thinner and these fat monster brushes. So let's just get started. I'm actually so excited for this, so let's go. All right, so we're gonna start by Cutting these scissors, these are, are the, this shirt. These scissors are not exactly fabric scissors, but it's the only one we have, so it's gonna work. All right, so I'm gonna cut it right here. Okay, and then once we get towards the middle, we're gonna stop it there, and we're gonna flip it. All right, now that we've gotten that, now we're gonna, well, flip it over, as I've already shown you. Cut this now right down the middle. Just like that. And now we're gonna cut it just like this. Guys, I literally saw this on Pinterest and I was like, you know what, we're gonna do it. So don't judge if it does not look very great. Okay, we cut that. Now, we are going to cut this side. It kinda looks like legs. Actually, it really does. Oh my gosh. Okay, perfecto. And now, okay, for my literal favorite part, we're gonna take this and I'm actually so excited for this. Okay, we're just gonna leave this how it is and we're gonna flip to this side. Low key, so freaking excited for this part. Not sure how it's gonna work. We're gonna try and see if it works, but I'm gonna take this and we're going to turn this into a pocket. Literally, I'm a genius, you guys. Like, what the heck? I'm just gonna start by, I'm gonna measure out. I'm actually gonna go with how the seam is and then we're just gonna draw. Guys, I never went to art school. I never did art in school. If these aren't on, then I'm so sorry. Alrighty then, I think that that looks actually beautiful. So, now we're gonna get our scissors. Our wonderful, handy dandy, non-fabric scissors. And we're just gonna cut this. Guys, I'm like low key, actually so proud of myself. I mean, I haven't even done it yet, so, so I maybe shouldn't be proud of myself yet. But, like, how wonderful is this idea? I should just become a DIY channel now we're gonna go over to the sewing machine. I'm gonna sew it and I'll be right back. Um, okay, so like, what the heck? Look at how beautiful that is, guys. Like, ah, I will have to wash it to get all this black stuff off, but look at that, like, oh my gosh. Now, what we are gonna do is, you guys are gonna see it from a side angle, but we have got our paint. We're gonna actually, for all this. Not sure what color we're gonna use, but actually I'm gonna shake it first. Shake it like it's hot, shake it like it's hot. You know, I think I should just start a shaking paint business. I think I'm like actually really good at shaking paint, guys. That could be my new business. Clay's paint shaking thing. Yep, I'm gonna do it. There's a lot of hair on this. That's not gross at all. We're gonna leave that there. So, now that we've got this, we're gonna get our paint brushes. So we're gonna take this color right here, just dip it barely in, and we're gonna start writing. Oof, wish me luck. Guys, you know what would be awful? Is if I accidentally spelled it wrong. Pocket full. Yeah, that pocket is kinda disappointing me right now. It's okay though. Oops. We'll pretend like that. Of. And now we're going to use another paintbrush, I guess. And we're gonna write sunshine in yellow, cause that's cute. Oh my gosh, I might just like scream of happiness. This is actually so cute. Um, all right, so low key screaming my head off right now because I'm so freaking proud of this. So now that this is done, we're going to take <laughs> This brush that looks like a highlight, a makeup highlighter. Actually, I wonder if it does work. Nope, it's too thick. We're gonna use that one and this one and this one and we're going to start making our little sunshine. I think we're going to actually, ooh, the knife is useful, guys. 
I'm gonna take some of this. This looks like mustard and ketchup, what the heck. Now we're gonna mix it together. So we're gonna start off with some yellow. Actually, no. We're gonna start off with some orange. I'm gonna kind of trace this, do that. That sure is beautiful. Okay, that's beautiful. Now we're gonna take some yellow and we're gonna go just around the outside. Okay, that looks kind of weird, but that works. Now I'm gonna add like a red in the middle. All right, so now that that's done, not sure how I feel about that, but it's fine. Now we're going to take this away and we're going to now tie the shirt. We're actually gonna take these scissors and cut them up a little more. Beautiful. And then we've got this crop. Oh, oh, that's not cute. Let's just cut those off. Okay, and there is the shirt. It's all done. We're gonna wait for this to dry and then I'll show you guys it on me. All right, so this second shirt is the ugly shirt that I don't like that my dad wears. We're gonna start off by chopping it off. We're gonna cut it right about here. Alrighty then. Here is the shirt so far. Now, I really do not like this. This looks super weird. So we're going to actually paint them pink because we love pink. Oh my gosh, that took so long and we only finished the W. Well, fast motion now. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, so after like 10 freaking minutes, that wasn't very long for you guys, but I got it done so you can see that it's done. Now, I really hate that there's like a freaking woodchuck so we are going to paint this entire thing pink and then maybe do some like cute designs with the gray paint that we've got right here. All right guys, there we go. Now we're just gonna have to wait for this to dry and then we're going to add like a big star or something. Maybe a heart, maybe we'll do a heart actually. So let's just let this dry. All right, so we have waited a little while. You can still see the freaking woodchuck stupid woodchuck thing, or yeah, woodchuck. That's super weird. So now it's time to draw the star. I'm gonna draw a star. Oh gosh, this paint is like dead, but we love. All right, so there we go. <clears throat> There's our cute little star. And here is the finishing touch of this shirt. All right, so um, last but not least, we've got these massive jeans that are definitely very large. So obviously for starters, we're going to be cutting them. We're gonna cut them right about here. Okie dokie, there we go. Now we're going to like, I'm kind of, I'm kind of feeling like doing some dots on like the sides. All right, we've got the pants and we've got these little things. I don't even know what to call it anymore. And our paint. And we're just gonna get started on doing like a few dot areas. So like, just like a little cluster right here and like here. So let's go. All right, so there's one. <clears throat> I'm think I think we need to do one down here. All right, now it's time for this side. This time we're gonna do one like right here on the very end. So, we got our pink little squishy thingy. So we're gonna get some of this pink. So cute. Now the pants are done. Let's try these on. And that's all. Oh. so surprised at how this turned out. It's actually pretty cute. I kind of wish that the sun was a little bit smaller, but 
It's a work in progress. Yeah, I'm actually so excited. I mean, guys, I did not expect this little tiny pocket to actually work, but I hand sewed it. No, didn't hand sew it. I sewed it on, and now there's a cute pocket, and it's cropped up, and it's just so cute. Okay, this is the second shirt. This I cropped, and then I painted the words and painted the woodchuck, because I didn't really want to have a woodchuck, because those aren't exactly the cutest things. So, here is the shirt. I really like it, and I love pink, so I definitely had to add the pink. And yeah, I think this is actually quite cute. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it um, as much as I did. Hope you liked the artsiness of it. I really enjoyed it, and I actually thought it was pretty great. The outfits turned out pretty good. I mean, I think I could have done better. Definitely could have done better, but they were still pretty good. I mean, I did have to do my dad's clothes and that's a little complicating. So I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed filming it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in these next two videos. Bye, I love you.